welcome back once again in this part we will complete our retype job post so now we need to implement our firebase recycler adapter inside our honest method in our previous part we create our custom view holder class now inside this honest method we need to we need to implement firebase recycler adapter and first parameter is going to be our model class that is data and our view holder class that is my view holder and adapter new firebase recycler adapter and inside this parameter we need to pass our model class our layout our database and our view holder class so first is our data dot class and second r dot layout dot job post item and our model class my view holder dot class and job post database so now view holder dot set job title model dot get title and view holder dot set job date model dot get date and view holder dot set job description model dot get description view holder dot set job skills model dot get skills and view holder dot set job salary model dot get salary so we added all this method and now we need to set our adapter with our recycler view so recycler view dot set adapter is adapter now now run this application hopefully we will be able to see our job post i think we did a mistake we need to add uh, this linear layout mass parent because we need to add it uh, add our recycler view mass parent now i think it's fine okay all right now we can run this application again all right so hit this run button once again and now we need to log in so edge at the rate gmail.com So h at the rate gmail.com and we need to add our password 1 2 3 4 5 6 and click this login button so login successful now if we click this post a job because we in here we retrieve our data for our on job post that we will post so now we can see our job post so we have two job posts so our title our date our description and our salary and our skill and our salary okay so inside our post job we can see we can only see our own job post that we will post but when we will move to our see all job posts then we will see all user job post for example if in our application we have 15,000 or million user and if all user post a job then we will see that job post inside our all job post but in here we can see only our own job post so i am a user now in this application so now i am posting a job now i can see only my job post so we need to create another public database so that all user can see each and other each and every person job post so maybe in our next part we will do it so now add some more job post so you can call it senior ios developer and the job description and we can call it we need ios We need iOS developer. And we need to add a skills. We can call it skills swift. And we need to add a salary. And salary is 80k.
now post a job now we can see our new job post so we successfully insert our job post and, and we successfully retrieve our job post from our firebase database so we can see now we have the job post and we, we inserted all the job post inside a card view uh we have two boats so i think that's enough for this part we can continue it from our next part so make sure that you are following me step by step okay so now if we have a look inside our firebase database we'll see three random key and inside three random key we have our all job post